Hello everybody, welcome back to Let's Play The Binding of Isaac Afterbirth. In this video we'll continue with a little bit of Samson, I think. Uh, yeah, I think a little bit of Samson is never a bad thing. Maybe only one run of Samson if nothing goes well, but, uh, you know. Gotta get some Samson in there, we just unlocked him. It wouldn't be fair if we didn't. To Samson, of course. We got Mom's Eye off the start, which wasn't exactly what I wanted. I was thinking it was Mom's Contact, and I was thinking I was set, but it was not Mom's Contact, and we are not set. Mom's Contact, of course, is the Freezing Tears, which is what I thought it was, but Mom's Eye gives us this occasional shot out of the back of our head, as you can see. Kind of, uh, kind of not great. But we're good anyway, who cares? It happens. We got it at least. Better than nothing. I guess it can synergize with some things. I hope at least. <laughs> I mean, what would we really want to be shooting out of the back of our head, though? I can't really think of things that I want shot out of the back of my head. I don't think it would work with Mom's Knife or Brimstone or anything like that. I mean, it would be cool if it did, but I don't think it does. Speed isn't really what we were looking for. We do have a bomb, so we'll come back to the next to the shop and look for the secret room, maybe? Like above the shop, is that where it could be, maybe? Here? Nope. Oh well. We looked. Alright, moving on. Burning basement numero dos. I mean, I guess we took out something there. Of course, now we have a tinted rock as well. Give me a bomb, please. Bomb and a key. Pill. Not quite. Health down. Wow. That is a horrible pill. And we have another tinted rock, of course. Tipton Rock number of dose. Further rubbing it in that we spent our bomb. Alright, once we have taken out all of those flies, we are free to take out the spawner. Have heart? Not exactly what I'm looking for. Two bombs is moreover what I need. Three bombs. Oh my, come on. Tinted rocks are coming fast and furious. And we need bombs. Bombs? Key. Alright, well maybe from our item room we'll get an item that gives us five bombs. Oh my. Really? Another tinted rock? Well, I mean, I'm not complaining, but we really need bombs. We need bombs super bad now, actually. If this item room gives us, uh, you know, something that gives us a ton of bombs, I think we'll be golden for a while. Or if we just get a golden bomb for a drop. That's not exactly what I was looking for, but, uh, you know. This is number two. As I'm sure you can tell, it's not very good. It does that. Yeah, you gotta kinda watch out for that, too. I think it'll also do it on rooms that have no enemies. So I think we might be able to just stand by a tinted rock for long enough. And eventually it would drop one. I would prefer to just find bombs and use those, honestly. But if that's what we gotta do, I guess I'm not completely 100% opposed to it. There's another key. I'm not really looking for another key, but I'll take it. I'd much rather have a bomb right now. Or a few. Hey, there's one. It's a start. Alright, we'll head back. Get one of the tinted rocks. I'm gonna stand here for about seven seconds just to see if it actually does drop anything. Because if it drops something when we're not in the room, then I could just cut it out okay. Of course. That's actually not that bad. 
Makes up for our health downgrade, I guess. Uh, we would like more bombs. <laughs> so maybe if the boss could give us the item that gives us bombs. Matchbook, is it? Matchbook. Little horn, give us matchbook. Little horn, I require matchbook. Matchbook, little horn, matchbook. The ball refused to die. Really? That didn't kill his ball. It looked like it exploded right next to him, too. Little horn, seriously, matchbook me. I know you got it in you. I know you want to give me that matchbook, Little Horn. I know you do. It's all I've ever asked from you. Aside from your own demise, of course, but matchbook. Not quite. Not quite. It feels so bad to just leave all of those tinted rocks behind. It feels so bad. There's one in this room here. I'm gonna grab our eternal heart real quick. There's one in... I think it's this room. Yep. So that's two. Ooh, there's a penny we forgot. We can check the shop actually in hope that there's a bomb in there. I mean a key and five cents for a spirit heart isn't the greatest thing in the world. But, uh, you know, it's not the worst thing ever. Well, depending on what we get from the the Tinted Rock, of course, actually. I shouldn't just straight up say that it's going to be a Spirit Heart. You never know. Of course. Infamy is actually pretty good. I mean, unlucky that we opened the two that were Golden Chests. But, to be fair, both the Golden Chests gave us some pretty good stuff. So... I can't be mad about that. Alright, don't think we forgot anything. We wanted to keep the five cents for an arcade, of course, so that we have a chance of getting the IV bag. Oh boy. Every time Hello everybody, welcome back to Let's Play The Binding of Isaac Afterbirth. In this video, we'll continue with a little bit of Samson, I think. Uh, yeah, I think a little bit of Samson is never a bad thing. Maybe only one run of Samson if nothing goes well, but, uh, you know. Gotta get some Samson in there, we just unlocked him. It wouldn't be fair if we didn't. To Samson, of course. We got Mom's Eye off the start, which wasn't exactly what I wanted. I was thinking it was Mom's Contact, and I was thinking I was set, but it was not Mom's Contact, and we are not set. Mom's Contact, of course, is the Freezing Tears, which is what I thought it was, but Mom's Eye gives us this occasional shot out of the back of our head, as you can see. Kind of, uh, kind of not great. But we're good anyway, who cares? It happens. We got it, at least. Better than nothing. I guess it can synergize with some things. I hope, at least. <laughs> I mean, what would we really want to be shooting out of the back of our head, though? I can't really think of things that I want shot out of the back of my head. I don't think it would work with Mom's Knife or Brimstone or anything like that. I mean, it would be cool if it did, but I don't think it does. Speed isn't really what we were looking for. We do have a bomb, so we'll come back to the next to the shop and look for the secret room, maybe? Like above the shop, is that where it could be, maybe? Here? Nope. Oh well. We looked. Alright, moving on. Burning Basement Numero Dos. I mean, I guess we took out something there. Of course, now we have a Tinted Rock as well. Give me a bomb, please. Bomb and a key. Pill. 
Not quite. Health down. Wow. That is a horrible pill. And we have another Tinted Rock, of course. Tinted Rock number of dose. Further rubbing it in that we spent our bomb. Alright, once we have taken out all of those flies, we are free to take out the spawner. Have heart. Not exactly what I'm looking for. Two bombs is more over what I need. Three bombs. Oh my, come on. Tinted rocks are coming fast and furious. And we need bombs. Bombs? Feed. Alright, well maybe from our item room we'll get an item that gives us five bombs. Oh my. Really? Another tinted rock? Well, I mean, I'm not complaining, but we really need bombs. We need bombs super bad now, actually. If this item room gives us, uh, you know, something that gives us a ton of bombs, I think we'll be golden for a while. Or if we just get a golden bomb for a drop. That's not exactly what I was looking for, but, uh, you know. This is number two. As I'm sure you can tell, it's not very good. It does that. Yeah, you gotta kinda watch out for that too. I think it'll also do it on rooms that have no enemies. So I think we might be able to just stand by a tinted rock for long enough. And eventually it would drop one. I would prefer to just find bombs and use those, honestly. But if that's what we gotta do, I guess I'm not completely 100% opposed to it. There's another key. I'm not really looking for another key, but I'll take it. I'd much rather have a bomb right now. Or a few. Hey, there's one. It's a start. Alright, we'll head back. Get one of the tinted rocks. I'm going to stand here for about seven seconds just to see if it actually does drop anything. Because if it drops something when we're not in the room, then I could just cut it out okay. Of course. That's actually not that bad. Makes up for a health downgrade, I guess. Uh, we would like more bombs. <laughs> so maybe if the boss could give us the item that gives us bombs matchbook, is it? Matchbook. Little horn, give us matchbook. Little horn, I require matchbook. Matchbook, little horn, matchbook. The ball refused to die. Really? That didn't kill his ball? Looked like it exploded right next to him, too. Little Horn, seriously, matchbook me. I know you got it in you. I know you want to give me that matchbook, Little Horn. I know you do. It's all I've ever asked from you. Aside from your own demise, of course, but matchbook. Not quite. Not quite. It feels so bad to just leave all of those tinted rocks behind. It feels so bad. There's one in this room here. I'm gonna grab our eternal heart real quick. There's one in... I think it's this room. Yep. So that's two. Ooh, there's a penny we forgot. We can check the shop, actually, in hope that there's a bomb in there. I mean, a key in five cents for a spirit heart isn't the greatest thing in the world. But, uh, you know, it's not the worst thing ever. Well, depending on what we get from the, the Tinted Rock, of course, actually. I shouldn't just straight up say that it's going to be a spirit heart. You never know. Of course. Infamy is actually pretty good. 
I mean, unlucky that we opened the two that were golden chests. But, to be fair, both the golden chests gave us some pretty good stuff. So, I can't be mad about that. Alright, don't think we forgot anything. We wanted to keep the five cents for an arcade, of course, so that we have a chance of getting the IV bag. Oh boy. Every time we have to, we hear that sound, we have to make a mad dash the heck out of there. Ooh. Perfect. Now we can get into our item room. Uh that's weird. The shop usually isn't over there. Sister Maggie is kinda bad. That might be a library. I'm going to save that full health poop there because it could be incredibly useful in the future. 48 hour energy does absolutely nothing for us. Oh, I almost destroyed it by accident. Oh boy. It does do it when we're not moving. And when we're not doing anything, I apologize for the train once more. You'd think the train wouldn't go by at such odd times. I purposely record at really weird times just to hope that the train won't go by. It is 2.24 a.m. right now. And the train is going by. It doesn't make any sense. Oh boy, we got hemmed in there hardcore. Larry Seniors ain't messing around. Oh, that should destroy them. I apologize for that, Larry Seniors. That was absolute destruction. D2 levels of destruction. There's another key. I guess that's fine if we can find enough money for our shop. I don't think that's the secret room because that poop is in the way, but it might be. I don't know. Hopefully we can find an arcade sooner rather than later, so that we can use it to get a nice damage upgrade, as well as a bit of money. Alright. Oh, that's a host. Mr. Host, man. Barely got out of the way of his shot, but we did. We'll save that until after. I think there was a tinted rock on the last room. I think I saw it at least. No arcade. No, that's not a tinted rock, is it? I don't think that's a tinted rock. I think I'm going crazy. I get fatty. Oh. Oh. We wanted to deal with the devil, but I mean, this is not what we're gonna do to get it. Mega fatty, really? You're gonna give us mega fatty? Oh, uh, we stepped on his creep. We had no way of going around him without doing that, though. Super unfortunate. I wanna blow up that TNT, but he's not letting us. There we go. Mega Patty, you gotta perish. Phew. I don't think we're getting a deal with the devil, but you know, it was a it was a valiant effort. The halo though, that's good. We'll take that. Uh, we'll look for a secret room. Could be next to our curse room or uh, whatever that room's called. I think it's called curse room, right? Huh. <sighs> Well, we don't really need to go into our shop. I guess we can check out what's in our mob trap room here, since this is the end of the floor. Uh, we have hearts on the ground, so we may as well. Our damage doesn't seem too bad, but we also have a bit of rage. So, I don't know if that's candid or if it's just from that. That was a good push of the bomb. Ooh, as was that. Fantastic. We're getting better with number two. Getting more used to it. Ten cents. It's pretty good. A pill is bad trip. That's not quite as good. But we do have hearts. Thankfully, we didn't have a spirit heart there to get bad tripped. Which would be unfortunate. There's a boss trap room, which we can't quite go into because we don't have one heart. 
we have more than that. We can only, of course, go into a boss trap room if we have one red heart or less. That was bad. Oh well, gave us a little bit of rage, I guess. This is literally the same room we were just in. <laughs> Just with different champions, and of course the champion over there is the one that's going to give us the pill. That will give us a pill wherever he is standing, which is unfortunate because we won't be able to get over there. He took a lot of hits though. There's an arcade for us, fantastic. Now all we need to do is, oh, I didn't get out of the way fast enough. Now all we need to do is find a little bit of health. Okay, there's a full heart in here. I'll take that for now, that's some damage for us. If we can find more health, I'll play it more. Because that's good damage for us. Number two, I don't think it's a terrible item. It's just really unreliable. Item room. We have plenty of keys. We just don't have very many bombs. Now we have one. Let's head into our item room. We don't want that. That's alright. Tears ups are always nice. Alright, this isn't too bad. Done. Perfect. 16 cents, that is now enough for our shop. Which is right here, I believe. Although this may be something else. I hope this is our shop. It is indeed our shop. We probably want this. This is a pretty good item. It shows us where things are located. Or no, it shows us the layout of the map. The compass, of course, shows us where things are located. Treasure map shows us the layout layout of the map. Very nice. We can take a guess where things are based on the layout. I'm not going to use our only bomb for that. We have another blood bank here. If we can get some red hearts to drop, that would be phenomenal. Here we have a double wide boss. What would be in a double wide boss? Two monsters, I guess. Good thing I saw that shadow. Oh, how did you even know I was going to be right there? You make no sense sometimes, monsters. That bomb out of here. Finish off this final monster. Take our item, which is HP. Take all the health we got, which was unfortunately only half a heart. So that's not good, but we do want to come back and play our blood bank because we may be able to get uh, the IV bag, which is a blood bank on every floor. That's what we want. We want to be able to spam that and get our damage up at the start of every single floor. So we're going to play this down to one heart, then we're going to check out the boss trap room. Like so. Now we do a lot of damage. We'll check out the boss trap room, as I said, over here. See what's in it. That is not exactly what we wanted. So I guess we'll play the three scroll Monty in hopes of getting some hearts. Those are keys, not hearts. I do want to save five cents for the next floor. So I, I mean, we might have to look for the secret room here. Oh, we have that poop. Don't we? I almost forgot about that. I think that's this floor, right? Or was that last floor? Oh, I think that was last floor. No, I got so excited. I thought we had the full health poop. I thought we had the full health poop on this floor. I think that was last floor. Oh, that would have been so good. Oh well. 
Uh, we were gonna look for a secret room. I think right here is appropriate for a secret room. The game agrees. We can get a full health pill, that would be good. Nothing. There's a pill. I'll use our last bomb. Tears down. Alrighty then. Um, we don't really want to go below five cents. So I think for now we should just go. I know it's bad and I don't want to go. But we really don't want to go below five cents. Because we need an arcade on the next floor as well. We need an arcade everywhere. So, I think we just gotta scoot. Unfortunately. Hopefully we can find a way to get some pretty nice health here. And then, uh, leverage that into more damage. That's what we're looking to do. Oh boy. We are looking to leverage some nice health into damage. Not through a deal with the devil as we normally would, but instead through a blood bank and or IV bank. Oh, that was bad. I walked right into it. I think there's only one ghost left. There he is. I think he's the last one. He was. Hmm. A couple tarot cards could be useful. Maybe we could get the sun from one of those. That would be full health. Really want to focus down that leaper. I came down here because I thought either our item room or our shop would be here. That was super close. 2020? Wow. 2020 is awesome. One of the best items. Well, not one of the best items, but one of the better items, I should say. Oh, thank you, fire. That's why you shoot fires. Hmm. Our shop is probably at the bottom of that uh, big room there. But right now, we don't really need to go to it. So I'm just going to keep pressing forward. Oh, I walked right into him. Fire, I apologize for having wasted your benefits. Oh, he dropped us a heart, though. Of course, because he's a red champion. How could I be so foolish? 2020 is sweet, though. It, of course, gives us this sort of double shot, as you can see. Unfortunately, it only works from the front. If it worked from the back, too, it would be even better. Our boss room is probably this way. They always put it in the more jerkish spot, so I would assume it's this way. Got a red heart. That's good. Two keys. Keys aren't the worst thing. I mean, we could use some other things, but I guess I'll never say no to a free key. There were many a time when hard mode was different that I would be lacking a key. So I will never say no to a free key. Alright. Oh. I didn't notice you guys escaped through the top. There's another key. in that seven of them now. This is the depths one, so we can come back out after we fight Monstro 2. Oh, yeah, right, Monstro. Yeah, right, you knew I was gonna go that way. I call Tom Foolery. Monstro shenanigans. Oh, our knockback almost made him knock back into us. We got a pill? What makes you larger? From what? How did we get a pill? Oh, Monstro. How are you getting your prediction game on point? Come on, Monstro. You're not that good. We all know it. There we 
go. Thank you, bomb uh, number two. Number two is what it's called. We'll go back and look some more for something. Something we would want. Maybe our shop is here? Okay, well, okay. This is horrifying, but... That is one of my least favorite rooms. I'm just gonna straight up say it. I don't like that. Our damage isn't half bad. Mainly because we have 20-20. Yep, there's our shop. Great chest with a half a red heart. Not quite what I was looking for. Mom's key would be phenomenal. I guess we'll see if we can find our secret room. See if mom's key is potentially able to be bought. I doubt it now, but you know, we looked. We'll keep looking, I guess. We'll go through the rest of the floor in hopes of finding, I don't know, a dime. <laughs> Hands aren't half bad. Four hands, I think that is all, because I don't see any more shadows. Oh, there's a host there, Mr. Hostman. Mr. Hostman. There's a red heart for us. And a penny. We're getting closer. We have three rooms left. <laughs> three rooms to get a dime. Or two nickels. I doubt we're going to get it, but, I mean, we're not going for a fast run here, so it doesn't really hurt to take the time to look. Red Patch. Alright, I mean, we already are Samson, so Red Patch, I don't think stacks, but, I mean, it's better than nothing, because that's literally what we had. Alright, well... I guess we'll buy the half price spirit heart because that'll leave us over five cents. Unfortunate that we couldn't get mom's um, key. That would have been very nice. I like mom's key a lot, one of my favorite shop items. Oh well. Then we go to the mom floor. That pill is one makes you larger, so I'm not too concerned about that. <sighs> okay, I thought I was far enough away to where that wouldn't have exploded on me, but I assume I was not then, if I was hit by it. This is bad. I don't like this room. Oh, perfect bomb kick, though. Oh, I tried to squeeze between them. I didn't notice that there was another one there. And when I did, I immediately regretted my decision. Puberty. Puberty isn't bad, but we've really been getting shafted by these pills. This is bad, too. Oh, perfect. I mean, if Purity Jr. just wants to run into our bombs more, that would be fantastic. Yeah, I'm not gonna say no if you want to run into our bomb, Security Jr. Instead you give us a key. Key is fine. Why did we even go this way? We know there's nothing here. I guess I was looking for an item room. Don't think we got anything. I didn't hear anything drop. Trying our best to use our range here. I don't want to be run into by these guys. The little sprint attack is kind of annoying to me. The only problem with using our range is our knockback is incredibly high. So it's kind of difficult to uh, continuously hit them. To sort of scope them. Oh, here's our shop. Oh no, that's a double key room. We have plenty of keys. Bombs. Alright, bombs is fine, I guess. 
I don't really want to blow that up. I thought about it, but I don't think we really need to. Four hands. So now we know. Black hearts. Black hearts good. These are leapers, so we have to be careful. They might jump on us. As will the big man. The big man is also a man of the jumping variety. Uh, this is the mom fight. Do we really want to do the mom fight right now? No. We still have to get our item room. Which I would assume is top right. Right? Yeah, it's got to be up there. Alright, we'll head up this way. See if our item room is up here. I heard a key on the floor, so... Somewhere on this floor, or this room, there should be a key. There it is. A key for a key in a chest, that's obviously worth it. That's a no-brainer. So we will be doing that. There he is. Oh, and we get a spirit heart from where we put the key. That's fantastic. And we get another key anyway. Two cents, not bad. It's a start. We don't really need the two batteries, but if we get a good space bar, then we could. Let me try to destroy those wall guys first. Here's our actual shop. And here's our item room. Monstrous Tooth. It's not good. It's not a good spacebar item, but we don't have a spacebar item, so... I guess it's good enough. We have a spirit heart. Portable slot or a bomb. I guess we can take the spirit heart. I mean, it's not exactly what we were looking for, but... Good enough. I don't really want to use a key on that, so... Especially when we already have one. It doesn't make a lot of sense to use a key for a tarot card when we already have a tarot card. Didn't go to the secret room, but I'm not too concerned about that right now. Oh, got hit by that, uh, that man's trailing shot. His post-mortem shot, if you will. Oh, monster, he did nothing. I, of course, used our card for that. We actually destroyed Mom pretty quickly. Our damage doesn't seem like it's all that bad. Almost went in there without going to the deal with the devil. There is a rock behind Satan, so I was hoping maybe it would be a tinted rock. But oh well. Down to the womb one. Where do we think Mom's heart would be? Probably, or the boss would be probably, probably that room to the left. Uh, this is, of course, ourself. This is easy. Oh boy, this is not very nice of you, game. We made it though. Shoot all this 